Blessed be the Lord power of Israel, for he have visited and redeemed his people. There's your separation. And again, we read it out of the New Testament. See? And have raised up an horn of salvation for us in the house of his servant David, as he spake by the mouth of his holy prophets, which have been since the world began. Yeah, and who is this horn of salvation here? Yahweh Shah. Proven that the Lord only shed his blood for the nation of Israel, and in particular the elect of the nation of Israel, in which the entire nation will benefit from in the world to come. See? Verse 71, that we shall be saved from our enemies and from the hand of all that hate us. And again, we read in the book of Exodus, the 15th chapter, where the Lord delivered us, he redeemed us from out of the hand of our enemies, which at that time was the ancient Egyptians. See, the story never changed. And we just read that in Malachi, the third chapter and the sixth verse. See, again, that we should be saved from our and you notice how this letter is personalized here. See? That we should be saved from our enemies and from the hand of all that hate us to perform the mercy promised to our fathers. See? And to remember his holy covenant, the oath which he swear to our father, see, to our father, Abraham. See that? Which that word father pretty much you know what let's click on this word father 